Early developmental milestones are high yield for the USMLE. Although you may not see a lot of these questions on your exam, you are guaranteed at least one or two, which are easy points if you can get some basics down. A typical question will give a presentation of a child and ask whether the milestones are appropriate for its age group. You will be asked to determine the child's development in categories such as motor, social, and verbal cognitive. This is going to be good practice for your pediatric rotation, as parents are always worried that their child is developing appropriately for their age. In this lecture, we will recognize the motor, social, verbal, and cognitive milestones in the infant, the toddler, and the preschooler. So first, we will be looking at the milestones for the infant up to age 12 months. When looking at the motor, social, and cognitive columns, you can use the mnemonic Parents Start Observing to help you remember the main milestones. Motor milestones in the infant age group include the child abandoning the primitive reflexes, which they are innately born with. First up, we have the moral reflex, which disappears by three months. The moral reflex is seen when you pull an infant up slightly and then release them. They first spread their arms, then pull the arms in, as if reaching out for something. This is usually accompanied by some crying. Similarly, the rooting reflex, which is a reflex to help babies find the mother's nipple, will disappear around four months. You can see this reflex by stroking the cheek of the mouth, which causes the baby to orient towards the side of the face that was touched. The palmer reflex is one of the most popular. It is seen when you touch the palm of baby's hand with your finger and they close their hand around your finger. This reflex disappears around six months. Lastly, the Babinski reflex disappears around 12 months. And yes, this is the same sort of Babinski sign that one sees in patients with upper motor neuron lesions. Do you remember which way the toes go in patients with upper motor neuron lesions? An upward motion of the toes is a positive Babinski reflex. Other motor milestones are also starting to appear. At one month, a baby can lift its head in the prone position. At six months, a baby can roll over and sit. And at eight months, the baby will crawl. At nine to ten months, the baby develops a pincer grasp. One way to remember this is with the memory tool that if you pinch your index finger and thumb together and point the rest of your fingers down, it looks like the number nine. Around nine to ten months, Babies also begin to stand, and around one year, the baby is starting to walk, though this can take up to 18 months. Social and cognitive milestones in the infant age group include smiling at two months and developing stranger anxiety after about six months, followed by separation anxiety at nine months. Around four months, a baby can orient to voice, but at what age does a baby orient to its own name? at nine months. Also around nine months, a baby develops object permanence, where babies understand that an object taken out of sight does not mean that it ceases to exist. About a month later, babies start saying mama and dada. At this age, around one years old, they can say single words. So remember the number one, but they can't put multiple words together yet. As some of you may be aware, Toddlers tend to act much differently. There is also the mnemonic child rearing working for this age group. By one year, most of them are already walking around and are able to climb stairs by 18 months. They are able to use forks and spoons by 20 months and are kicking balls by 24 months. Another good tool that is a marker for motor development is that a child should be able to stack cubes by their age times three. So a two-year-old should be able to stack how many cubes? Correct, six. Social milestones include parallel play at 24 months, where the child may sit next to another child of their age and play, but not necessarily together. 
reproachment by 24 months, which is when a child will run away from mom for a few moments and then returns back quickly, and the child will realize their core identity by 36 months. Verbally, these kids are able to use 200 words by age 2 and 300 by age 3. Finally, we have the preschool-aged kids. We'll use the mnemonic, don't forget they're still learning, for this one. Preschool motor milestones include driving a tricycle at 3 years, drawing a line, circle, or stick figure by age 4, and their dexterity increases, allowing them to hop on one foot by age 4, and being able to use buttons, zippers, and dress themselves by age 5. Socially, these kids are able to spend time away from mom for part of the day by three years and are able to participate in cooperative play, where they can play in the same game with other kids by age four. Verbally, they are able to understand 1,000 words by age three and able to use complete sentences and tell detailed stories by age four. Flash quiz. At what age does the moral reflex disappear? The moral reflex disappears at three months old. So, in this lecture, we learned that there are a variety of milestones that help parents and pediatricians gauge how well a child is developing, and failure to meet certain milestones are clues to start help looking for reasons that the child's development is being stunted. Thanks for watching, and be sure to click thumbs up if you enjoyed this video.